Hello guys, welcome to Khan's Cat Academy with another tutorial after a really long time. In this tutorial, we'll be learning about how to import your SolidWorks file and other type of formats into AutoCAD and then save them as DWG format. So, let's start with opening the file in the SolidWorks first. This is the, op this is the file which we received from one of our subscribers and which need to be, wor need to be converted into .dw .dwg format. So, in SolidWorks, you, you, you have nothing to do in it to convert into a DWG format. So, this is the file. Now, I'm going to close this file and I'm going to open the AutoCAD. In AutoCAD, I go and open a new file. And please remember, uh, when converting the file, you must close the file in the SolidWorks, right? Then you come here in the AutoCAD and make a new file as I did and then type a command which is import and when I press enter now this is the same file which is in which we can see that it is in SOLIDWORKS format when I click on it and then I click on the open it started it has started to work on it and it's it gives us a message after some time that import file processing is complete and the translated file is ready to be imported then you have to click on this file in order to open it. Now it has opened, but don't worry if you cannot see it, you can zoom out. Zoom out. If you cannot zoom out more, you can give the command as regenerate. It's RE, you press enter, and then you can zoom out it more. Okay, now go to the view, sorry, view, and then you change from the wide frame to conceptual and then you get to see the file and you go and click on the rotate file R rotate command you can rotate it in the orbit and you get the same file here yep the same file here now what I should do I go to I go to the menu and save it as the DWG or any other format you want in the AutoCAD you can save it anywhere so guys this is all the tutorial is about I hope you like the tutorial and don't forget to subscribe and share and before ending I will also like to tell you that I have tried this in AutoCAD 2015 in case you're trying with others other versions please mention in the comment section and we'll try to work it out if it's not going to happen in by the same command I hope you like the video, don't forget to subscribe and share, peace out.